Andy and Dave Daly right here on the Muskegon Channel. I'm Andy O'Reilly. There's Dave Cackley. Is it, is it, what, is it Wednesday? No, it's, Thir- Thursday. it's Thursday. Thursday. Wow. I, they just run together, man. They never stop. It's the same thing mm-hmm. day after day after day. I like it. I see. I'm a big fan of consistency. See, that's I, and I get that. Some people call it mundane. Some people call it, you know, whatever. Is it Tuesday? Is it Thursday? Ways. I can't keep it straight. I don't know. Just show me my schedule and tell me where I have mm-hmm. to be and when. Good mm-hmm. enough. But um, you, you know, you're doing all these stories about the economy and all that kind of stuff, and yeah, I'm thinking, um. Stop sneezing. Cindy's out there sneezing in the kitchen. Can you uh, believe that? Yeah, it's a, it was a, International broadcast going on, and she's yes. she's to be in the kitchen to sneeze. Oh. Well, now she's going in my bathroom. Oh my gosh. Getting my cold pills. Well, here you go, Al. Well, you know what? Here's the here's the thing anyway. She already imbalanced the whole cold pill pack. It's done mm-hmm. like you, you can't have just one cold pill taken out. Sounds like with, with all this you're dealing with, maybe you'll have a delicious pie in your near future. I don't know that I'm going to get a pie. I, I, I have heard no plans for pie. I have No had, plans for pie, no cake. I have had nothing but Christmas snacks hidden on me all year long. I can't find them anywhere. Will um, the ironing be done? Uh, ironing? No, there's no ironing here. I don't, no ironing? No, I take ironing. Oh, that because you're neatly pressed. You, you're neatly pressed shirts, I thought. You know. I take Well, I take all the ironing down to the ironing place where they do the cleaning and ironing. Okay. That's not what okay. wives are for. Maybe that's why you haven't gotten one yet. I don't no, know. I see. see, I... I but I was... Wait this, wait, this is not 1978? No. We're not there. No, we're not living no, in 78? for you. Calgon, but take I, me away, all that good stuff? I was getting around to an idea here for... Ancient a, Chinese a, secret? I'm sorry. A little something for your uh, stocking this year okay um and since you know it's not even opened yet and so i technically i would guess this is a, a true collector's item mm-hmm. and i'm thinking it might be your year okay we'll see you know i i had a gift i wanted to give you and you I, put the kibosh just, yeah, on no it. i don't want to do gifts this year but, th- but this, I, is little, this is just a little something for me I, yeah, well, I didn't need anything back i was just well, gonna, like, I this had is like the nice boss giving to the okay the the underling the the this is like the employee christmas gift well, okay, but that's fine. What do you think? Genesis, The Last Domino. Oh, Jesus. All their Dude, greatest hits. Win? Double disc. Abacab all the way they to... Don't, they, um, don't have, they don't have enough good songs to, to, to make half of one side of a disc. Oh, they do, too. Come on. Sorry. You, you listen to this for two weeks straight, and it'll get you out of your Eagles problem. No, it will not. I don't have an Eagles problem. That is... That is you, my friend. And again, yeah, all, we went over problems. this. We, we went over this a de- over a decade ago. Well, we're going over and, it again. No, we don't need you're to. Because you're going to become you're going to become happen. a convert. I will not become a convert. No, uh, not going to. Uh, I'm not going to switch to Genesis. I'm not going to renounce my faith in Christ. These things aren't going to happen. I'm not going to. I'm not going to all of a sudden grow hair. Home by okay, the that's sea. Not, there's, no. Tonight, tonight, tonight. No. Ooh. Abacab. Again. Abacab. <sighs> Think no. about that. You keep your eye on the mailbox then, big fella. Coming your way. Uh, well, you know, I could use a coaster. Because, you know, sometimes the, you, you get the, the tables, you get rings on them when you leave a beverage. I got my uh, caffeine-free Coke Zero. I set that down. No coaster. There's going to be rings. Okay. So I could use the Genesis CD as a coaster. All right. Well, I'll send that in the pie. I still have the pie. Be right, too. right up there with the uh, with nice the Van Halen, Van Halen Four, <laughs> Gary the Gary Sharon era. <laughs> that was roll brilliant. some news or something. What? You, I'm trying to be amused here. Let's let's get into it. The U.S. Senate passed a defense bill on Wednesday. The legislation authorized the biggest pay raise. For U.S. troops in more than 20 years, 5.2% pay increase is part of a whopping $886 billion package for the current fiscal year. Now, no question, troops deserve a raise. Uh, nobody yes. argued that. But where the hell are we getting this money? I, print, I, print, still, print, I still have print, taxes print. to pay yet this year. So, <laughs> you know, they're probably waiting on me. Yeah, uh-huh, right. Good Lord. What else is going on? According to new research, ChatGPT has not led 
to an increase in cheating. This according to a new bullshit study from Stanford, the percentage of students who cheat remain statistically unchanged despite the availability of the chatbot tool. Around 60 to 70 percent of students engaged in cheating in the past month. Okay, just because the numbers haven't gone doesn't mean there isn't more cheating. They're getting better at cheating. Oh, there's a way you use chat GPT and uh, like Max got busted for this, I think, like a year ago and everybody was using it. Uh, the problem is, you know, like he, he would use chat GPT to do a paper or something, and it doesn't sound like a seventh back then when he was in seventh grade, right. like a seventh grader wrote it. So now you got, oh, you get that. So you get whatever the chat GPT creates, and then you just change some words around. There's ways to do that. Whether you're talking middle school, whether you're talking high school, whether you're talking college level. I know I, I know a lot of people, a lot of adults using this stuff for their jobs. And it's, again, it, it's a technology we're not we're not going to disinvent. So you got to nope. work with it. Yep. If you're a teacher, I know my, my sister who teaches over on the east side of the state has, has had to deal with this. Uh, and she's been pretty adept at catching kids with this, but they're just going to get more sophisticated. They're just, they, they grew up with this stuff. They know how to use it. And now that it's here again, I, I don't even know that it's cheating anymore because everybody's got access to it. So you gotta, it's like with any technology that's not going to go anywhere. You know, I know the AI overlords are eventually going to kill us. We know that the end of humanity will be eventually be AI, whether it's, five years, a hundred years, 500 years, whatever the time frame is. But in the meantime, got to be able to work with it before, you know, they eventually destroy us. So there you go. Okay. Thank you, Alex Jones Jr. What? I'm actually two years old. I'm older than Alex Jones. AI is. Alex oh, Jones is only okay. 50. You're right. AI oh. is going to kill us. You're good. You're good. Okay. What? Okay. Okay. You can, uh, that's just my view of it. If you have a counterpoint, Go ahead. I will sit back. If your and kid's listen. using AI to do a, p a paper, kill him. Mm -hmm. but, I mean, that's un intolerable. Really? Content is always going to win when it comes down to the battle between AI and original thought. Always. It will always it, it win. It really isn't. Okay. It, it re you understand. You A lot of people can't. They uh, Actually, CNN did a, did a thing on this. Michael Smirkanish, less than, I think about six or eight months <clears> ago. <throat> on his Saturday morning show, did something. He's like, and, and then he stopped and said, that last script was entirely produced by AI. Yeah. He did it to prove a point. You couldn't discern it. You couldn't okay. tell. So that's just where, you know, the idea that this is always going to trump that, it's not. Okay. But how do you work? But again, you got to incorporate it. Uh, the danger is it replacing you. And this is, I mean, that's not a conspiracy. That's just a, this is where this is going. Unless, unless we're able to get a handle on it, but okay. we're, we're rarely able to get a handle on these things. So, I mean, maybe you have more faith in humanity that uh, getting its arms wrapped around this than I do. And good for you. Uh, finally, more than 700,000 Michigan households will receive a tax credit check next February. The checks are uh, meant to make up for the 24% a difference of families uh, were owed after their 2022 tax season. The wow. checks will average around 550 bucks. Uh, the earned income tax credit was increased to 30% uh, earlier uh, this year. So, I mean, that's just one of those. It's not like, like you're already owed this. This is not, hey, they're giving us this thing. No, this was already our money in the first place. So. Oh, okay. Sports. Pistons yep. lose again. Oh, no. Big surprise. Philly hammers Detroit 129 to 111. 2 and 22. 0 for November. 0 for December so far. This could be a historic. Remember a few years back when the Tigers were uh, flirting with the worst record in Major League Baseball? The Lions, of course, uh, hit the big 0 and 16 mark before anybody else did uh, a decade plus ago. But it's looking like this could be the year of futility in Motown for the Pistons. Wings were off. Wings are still pretty good. So, you know, if you're a sports wings, fan man. in the state, you got the Wings, you got the Lions especially. Uh, yeah, it's a good – it's okay. And I, honestly, okay. I'm a little disappointed that, you know, you always bring up if you're a sports fan in Michigan, you got the Lions, you got the Wings. 
you've got the Pro Bowlers Tour. You could always watch exciting things like lumberjack competitions or the strongman competition. Uh, you you leave out the important sports that people actually mm-hmm. enjoy. Golf, right? Um, that's that's fun to watch. I, I I discuss golf when there's a major championship or something. I don't. I'll say I, hey, I just this I, guy won it. Okay, all right. Well, so you know, I'm, I'm sorry. I I'm sorry. I, on you. I missed out on the the latest. You're the chat GPT. Because yeah, as we all know, if I just tell know, them the piston score, they'll be happy. That's that's, that's uh, chat GPT. Dude. It's like you know what? Uh, let me let me put it this way. I know what the people want. I had this argument with an old boss of mine years ago. Yeah. When I was doing, I was doing news. I was doing news in sports for the Urban Station, the oh, lone yeah. Urban Station in Grand yeah. Rapids, and he asked me, "Why don't you ever talk about the Red Wing, the 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 Red Wings or or NASCAR?" I said, "Because black people don't give a shit about NASCAR or hockey. I know what the audience wants. You do. It's like I know what this audience. There you go. I know they want to know about piston futility, and what the Red Wings are doing, and what the Lions are doing." And what the Tigers are doing. So there you go. I know. I'm tuned in. Tuned into the masses. I'm from Middleville. And I really know what the urban core of listeners mm. wants. Uh, you can't? Oh, yeah. No, no. No. They're really interested in Bubba Wallace. That's what they want to know what Bubba. Yeah. There, there we go. Bubba, there you go. All right. one of, 400 bucks on the line today. It is behind the musical title. Behind the music, is it wait? Is this a new category? They, I don't think we did this yet. on on from time to time, and then and again on Jeopardy, they change categories. Yeah, I know. I just if it was always one said, category, hey, new category, it would, it, would, it would limit us in our questions, wouldn't it? Absolutely. I just usually, as as Alex would do, as as good hosts of any game shows, uh, we've we've got a new category. Well, bada, what bada, I did, bada. I put my own spin on it. I said the number first, and then I gave you the category. Okay, but you didn't say it was a new category. That's difficult when things don't go in the right order. It, mm-hmm. it, so, 400 today. You got that part. Okay, what's the category? Behind the, the category. musical title. Behind the musical title. Okay. Okay. I'm get ready. your mind where it needs to be? Mm-hmm. Yes. You sure? I effed up yesterday. You did. Should have known it was Robin Hood. Went with, went with Christopher Robin. That's on me. And I'm going to tell you We're what. Gonna, if you get this one today... Story. Everything is confirmed. What? What? Like what? This Broadway musical's title refers to the fabulous new footwear at the Price and Sons factory in Northampton. I see. You think I'm not going to get this? You think Northampton? He's not going to have any no, I, idea. I told you exactly that... what I thought. Going no, into. you said if you get this, you'll be impressed. Did you say you'll be impressed? Did you allude no, to being I, no, impressed? No, what I said I was if you is. get this, it's going to give away a lot. When uh, well, when I when you say no, you, you you gave it away when you said Northampton. I did because it's got to be it's got to be the Jersey Boys. Got to be. You managed to be that dumb and what are you talking yourself. about? That's amazing. That is amazing. The Jersey That's amazing. Boys. It's right. No, it's not. What? It's kinky it's boots. It's not the Jersey Boys. No, it's not. It's the Jersey Boys. Oh, nobody know kinky boots? That's made up. You're making shit up. Oh, good God. I don't feel bad getting that wrong because I was sure it was the Jersey Boys. Well, you be sure all you like. That's I think, Having yeah, confidence I think, in I, yourself is important. I, I wish it you the is. best, and I guess we're on to a Friday at this point. I'm going to go uh, it was the Jersey the Genesis Boys. CD. Okay, you, you enjoy turn that. It on, turn it up, turn it on again. Sing along, you know the words. Take it to the limit. Ooh, One boy. more time.